Thank you. It's my brand new apartment. What I mean is, at first it looked like false advertising. Thought it would cost too much for something I didn't need, an impulsive desire, a first world country dream I couldn't afford to imagine. This is how I remember the moving day. I sat on a warm hardwood floor, curtains of curated memories all over the place. There's a box smelled like lingering burnt jepun and cendana and crackling kretek mixed with mountain air. On the table was thali with sunny garlic naan we passed around. Thank you were names melted into layer of skin I am carrying everywhere, constantly giving without permission. Sunsets easing fear into spools of thank you I scooped with open palms, stitched them into poems. Strangers held them like a newborn child. This is where my spine learned to stretch into a living room for compliments instead of crawling into compromise. There's a box of thank you. Dancing to a no man high enough, 1 a.m. We were warm beer on the floor, swirling, swaying, swinging to the same tune of thank you I have mastered to sing by heart. There's a box with more boxes inside, pocket-sized gratitude. I put one with the most familiar thank you. It's back home. It's forgiving. Is forgiven. What I mean is I spent the whole day unloading. Put where they belong, everything. Watching the walls and corners slowly turn into arms and dip myself to heal. What I mean is, my new apartment doesn't have a balcony or any overhead beam strong enough to carry me. What I mean is, the ceilings are not chasing me. This house comes with gravity. It is such an unfamiliar feeling to be wanted by the ground and not three feet under this time. What I mean is, here, I no longer point at love and call it a rescue mission. I do not mistake blisters and scars with birthmarks now. Thank you led me to people who love like it's the only thing that they have ever learned and their heart is a city I will always return and every homecoming taught me thank you. And thank you taught me that in this house, I do not have to shrink myself to feel safe. What I mean is sometimes I feel bigger than this city and still as empty as this city and it's all good. What I mean is, in this house we speak the language of gratitude and my mouth recites thank you without an aftertaste of guilt. Happiness is still a seasonal guest, but the doors are always unlocked. When I say thank you is my brand new apartment, Today, it is a waiting room of delayed arrival and time is just something we eat for dinner some days. It's a museum for things I rescued from the burning houses that doesn't look like death. Some days, the smoke follows me home, lurking in the dark, but haven't you heard that the greatest victories wouldn't have been written in history without witnesses? What I mean is, there is no house that is not haunted. What I mean is, thank you is my brand new apartment. What I mean is, it is haunted. What I mean is, thank you. I am not the ghost anymore.